Hi, everybody. Welcome to Koken's Corner for Tuesday, the 7th of September. Glad to have you with me, and I'll be looking at a college football game for this weekend as the free play. Uh, quick commercial message. I'm number one all-time at Wager Talk in college football overall net profits and winning percentage and got out of the gate really well with a 4-1 and one record in week one, and that included a perfect 2-0 and oh on the free plays. Look to keep that going uh, with the selection here. And if you want to get everything else, just go to wagertalk.com, my homepage there, wt.buzz slash DC. Eastern Michigan is at Wisconsin. It's a big number, 25 and a half, 26. And it probably should be bigger than that. Wisconsin, uh, I won't call it an unbelievable loss, but in some ways it was. They ran 90 plays last week against Penn State. The Nittany Lions only ran 50 plays. It's really unusual for a team to have a 90 to 50 uh, plays run advantage and lose the football game. Wisconsin should not have lost this football game. They had several trips inside the Penn State 10-yard line and simply did not make the most of them. Their play calling was not good uh, in the red zone. Mertz was, quite frankly, terrible. But there were a lot of things that Wisconsin did really well in this game, and Eastern Michigan doesn't have any way to defense those things. Look for the jet sweep. They ran it three times last week against Penn State. It worked every time. I don't know why they stopped running it. Good running backs here should have a big day against, against an Eastern Michigan defense that's soft in the interior. Unless Wisconsin is down mentally from last week, this is a really good bounce back spot, and I think that's exactly what they'll do. Wisconsin minus the points is the free play. Thanks for watching, and good luck.